Hey everybody, uh, doing a video now because lives are getting kind of crazy. Um, life's been a little crazy and y'all know why. <laughs> so anyways, I'm coming on here real quick uh, just to update you on what I'm doing to stay sane. Um, and uh, yeah, so if y'all know, I do essential oils. So, um, and I'm also into spirituality and a lot of things like that. Do you like my new shirt? Or, uh, Aid got it for me, so it was really cool. I thought it would go with today. Everybody needs a little more positivity and sparkle and good stuff. <laughs> so, anyways. So, as you know, you know, the, sometimes the, the New Age shops have what, like, these pendant things. And they're actually diffusers. Uh, you can get them wherever. I got this one up at my local one. Um, here in town a while back. And it's got, like, a little pad that you can put the essential oil on and then just wear it and it's a diffuser. So I haven't done this. I used to do uh, Dragon Time in this one for a long time ago, but I switched it out and I haven't been using it in a long time. But then I thought, you know what? I think I'm going to start doing this now because uh, I need to get rid of the crazies around me right now. So what I figured is in spirituality, we all know that sage essential oil keeps away the crazies. And it goes, it goes well with uh, deterring negative energy, uh, which also goes with panic and stuff like that. And it calms the auric field and things like that. And also, it's a really good essential oil just to just relax. Now, I like to do the essential oil versus the actual um, burning of the sage leaves only because I have pets around and it's kind of hard if they're jumping on tables and things if you're having the, um, the actual leaves burning and then you, you know, blow them out so that they smolder, you know, like smudge sticks and things like that. I don't really want that around my pets and my pets, especially my cats are uncontrollable and they like to get into everything. So it's safer for me to do the essential oil. Um, but anyway, so, and there's a lot of other research on sage essential oil with certain other things going around. Um, so look that up yourself. I did some research myself and I was actually kind of like, oh, okay, this is uh, great for more than what I just thought it was. So get yourself some sage. Um, ow. Anyway, um, whoop, see, it's magnetic, so that's cool. So anyways, I was going to show you how I do this. Alright, so you just put one drop in, in the top part there, or two, depending on what you want, how strong you want. I'll do two. Oop, and then it just closed, so that's the universe telling me that it's fine. Actually, I might put three because it still kind of smells like dragon time, so it's not as strong. For you guys, it'd probably be fine for just one, but this is an older um, pad that's in here that I didn't change out. So if it's a new pad, just two drops would be fine. If not, one drop. Um, there you go. That's better. Um, then you kind of... I just... Because it's old, I haven't changed it out. I don't have the other replacement pads that were in here. Um... And this one I've swapped back and forth. I've taken the little pad out and then swapped it back and forth. But basically, that's what I do. And then I just put it on me. And it's another warding element. Whereas my selenite also keeps away any negativity. Um, and then my other pendant that I got, which apparently is some good pendant. Um, everybody loves it too. It's uh, Roycroft made, which is really cool. I love it. I'm so glad I bought it with my tax money last year. Um... And now I have the added sage. So no crazy, crazy people going to be near me. It shields me from crazy people and keeps my aura and my my immune system up and powered and good. So anyways, sage essential oil, not clary sage, sage, which is salvia officianus. I don't know if you can see that, but uh, you can't read it. Salvia officianus or whatever. So get that one. And uh, rid yourself of the craziness and just sit there and watch other people go crazy. And you can just sit there and be zen. Alright, I'm going to get going, but I figured I'd just uh, share my hair's all messed up. That little tidbit of information with you during this really historic crazy time. Alright, stay sane, people. Fear is the bane of everything. So don't let it get you. Because when you're fear, your immune system gets compromised. So you're playing into it too, unfortunately. All right. Love, light, and blessings, everybody. I'm here to support you. Namaste. See ya.